Mumbai is the obvious place. I mean, if it continues growing the way it is, and it will, it's going to become larger than Tokyo in 25 years' time. Right? Half the population of people in Mumbai now uh, are living in slums. That's the population of London. So imagine what it might be like if it becomes as big as Tokyo with the populations of New York and London living in slums without water and all that. I mean, it's that, those are the reasons why we looked at that. Istanbul is fascinating because it's one of the youngest cities in the world at the moment. It's the most happening city. It's a cool city. Its economy has picked up. And of course, it's a European city, or half of it is. So that's an interesting uh, dimension. It's not a very remote problem, which only uh, is, is something that you know, people in Africa, people in, in South America, or people in Asia need to think about. And Sao Paulo is you know, the engine of Brazil. And Brazil is rapidly becoming one of the most dynamic and positive um, sort of economies in the world. And to see what's happening there, I think, is relevant to all of us.